Hello, everybody. This, this is good stuff right here. Anybody in the collecting world that has ever received a baby knows just what this box means, this brown box. Um, inside is a very special baby that came my way um, unexpectedly. I swear I didn't know I was pregnant. Um, but last week I found out that I was and um, an opportunity presented itself that I was so not going to walk away from. Like <clears throat> some people get buyer's remorse, like they buy a doll and then they feel like, "Ooh, I should not have done that. This would have been a doll that I didn't buy and I would have had buyer's remorse on the flip side. Like, ooh, damn, I wish I would have done that. So, here I am, and I'm about to get a baby, to which I didn't know I was pregnant. Um, and I thank now uh, Faith KP for sending her, and um, this is a doll by an artist that I have had on my list forever. In fact, I've been a group. Uh... Hi, this is Wishes. She is, uh, she is certainly the baby of the family. Uh, the little princess. Um, say hi to everybody, of course. Bye. Goodbye. She's really cute, um, but she demands to be the center of attention always. Um, okay, so this is from an artist. Uh, this doll is made by an artist that has been on my top list. Um, and I have my, I have a couple that have been like that. I saw Jenny Lee, um, Romy Stridum. I have quite a few that are like my keepers. And this is uh, a baby by Joanna Kay. So, uh, Kazmir Zak. And I <laughs> fell in love with this baby from the minute I laid my eyes on her. And like I said, there was no passing her up whatsoever. So this came from um, Faith KP, Kristen, and um, she did a fabulous job getting her out to me. I know it wasn't easy, and I thank her for that. Um, and she did a great job packing this little one. I already opened the box, obviously, and took out um, the uh, 542,317 peanuts that were in there. By the way, I've decided that if you don't want your box to be um, uh, taken, like scammed or opened up and something happened to the baby, you should put peanuts in there because I was like, oh my gosh, you know, if anybody was looking to steal something out of a box, like, you know, valuable or whatever, peanuts are such like those little, these little things, peanuts, these things right here are such a great deterrent. Who, who likes like dealing with those things? Nobody. Those would be like perfect because the person would be like, oh my God, is it even worth finding out what it, like what's in the bottom of this box? I have to like go through the peanuts and not only like pull them all out, but then like put them all back in or I'm gonna be leaving a trail behind me. So anyway, that's the shit that goes through my head sometimes. Totally like random, but kind of makes sense. I don't know. Okay, here it is. Here's my baby. Just kidding. Anyway, that's a cute little bear for her. And it is a girl. I have a couple little things that, Faith, I'll put this one, put her over there. Whew, she's heavy. A couple little things that Faith sent. She didn't need to, I told her that. But being a dear friend, she insisted. Oh my, wow, cute. That's a cute little knit set and so soft. Now this baby is going to be unique, thank you Faith, to my collection because she's like darker hair. And all of my babies for the most part have the light brown, dark blonde hair. And so it's like, I don't know, kind of cool that she's going to have a, a different color to her. She's a little darker. Oh my goodness. I love it. I'm sorry, but does anybody else just, oh my goodness, she is totally going to rock that. Does anybody else not just love baby clothes? I know you guys do for the most part if you're watching this video, but I mean, hello, that's adorable. Faith, I told you you didn't need to do any of this, Kristen. 
I just, uh, I never know what to call you. God love you. Oh my gosh, look at how sweet. That is adorable. And I have a little white sweater that would look adorable over it. Oh my gosh. Look at how cute. I love these. I love these because they're so soft and I never feel like they're gonna mess with their head. Okay, it's baby time. Oh my. Now this little one is heavy. Holy cannoli, whoa. All right, Whew. my workout's done for the day. Peanut. By the time I'm done with this video, I have proven my point about the whole peanut thing. Okay, baby bear. She, uh, oh my gosh. That's a heavy load. And by the way, excuse the fact that I have a hat on. I did shower today. That's rather impressive. I've gone over the top today. But I mean, I didn't feel like doing my hair. I mean, it's raining out and really, truly, all I'm going to do is go pick up my kids today. And I probably won't even get out of my car. I'll just park right in like the front row. Like I cheat kind of. And then they have to just like, they see me because I'm like right there. So I'm like, okay, well, I'll just get there 20 minutes early and sit there so that I get a good spot. So I'm that token parent. Oh my, oh my. Now, if any of you have been following the page for um, Faith, you will recognize perhaps this baby. Do you recognize that little hand? I love it. Look at those fingers. Now, Joanna K definitely has like a painting style all of her own that I love. It's so detailed. Not now, wishes. Please. And I have been so like curious to know what her um, silicone feels like because it. I don't have one like this. So, Kristen was telling me that it's kind of like that silicone that you. Um, it's not quite Eco 20. It's kind of like a blend. Holy cow! I'm like really close to the camera. My apologies. But like it's a blend and so it's it's not necessarily eco 20 but it's not like like a marshmallow either where it like just dangles all over the place this is and you're right it's like a it's like you push this and it like rises up slowly I've ne I never had a baby with this feeling to her holy cannoli that's pretty sweet okay let's see her little itty bitty feet Let's pull them out of here. Oh, she's got socks on. A little teaser. But we're going to take those off. Oh my gosh, though. Look at those socks. Oh, she looks adorable. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh my. When I was a little girl, I wore ruffle socks. So I sort of have like a, I don't know bias towards them. I love them. If only I could get my daughter to wear them, but she's too cool for that. Oh my goodness. Oh, her silicone. I wonder if you can see that. Can you see that? Can you see? Wow. Wowzer. Wowzer. Holy moly. I have some fabulous dolls and this one, I mean, is right on up there. And I'm gonna tell you, she's just a, she, it like squishes and it comes like back. I can't, it's like one of those pillows kind of, um, like memory foam or something. I, it's unbelievable. She feels like a baby. Imagine that. But really, for real, she has like a really cool feel to her and it's, I love the fact, and it's so cool to um, have babies by different artists because they all are so unique. Nonetheless, like they're they're all amazing, um, but they're so unique in the fact that their painting styles are different, and now like their blends are different. So the feel of the doll is so much different. Um, it's it's kind of crazy to think that you know they can make such a variance in all of their different 
um, babies, but it, but they truly do. And each of them kind of has like a unique feel for each artist. So these, this silicone is incredible. Look at those little toes. Hi, I have cute feet. Oh goodness, look at the wrinkles. Oh my gosh. This little, this little peanut, she's got some rolls. She's got some wrinkles. And I've never had a baby that's been like on the chubbier side. My Romy, my Gracie, she's she's a little heavier. She's definitely bigger than, <clears throat> excuse me, my Ella. But she um, but she doesn't have like crazy rolls or she doesn't have any like chubsters, you know, chubbiness to her. Um, this little one has got herself a little belly, a belly belly. Marley, you guys have to share the bone. I'm sorry, I live in a zoo. And I'm just, I'm used to it, but you're probably wondering, like, what's going on in that house. And don't worry about it. It's just my dogs. There's 15 of them. Just kidding. There's two. But, I mean, they're enormous. And they like to play, and they cry while they play and have fun. And it's really weird. But I'm used to it. I used to teach, so I've learned how to, like, tune things out. Like, there could be 20 kids in my house, and I'd be over here like, oh, my God, look at her little her little fingers that's kind of the truth um oh my. <gasps> okay. let me see you're probably like what what are you looking at this is what i'm looking at look at this little belly here let me do this oh i saw these diapers n-a-t-y the natty diapers i almost ordered some of these because i thought their print was really different and unique and I love collecting diapers because <clears throat> I'm weird like that. Um, look, look. Can you see? It's like, is that a real baby wrapped up in there? Because it surely looks like one right now. And you know, all of you watching probably know that this is a doll, obviously, because, well, it says it in the title and also because you're you probably googled it or you saw it on the you know Facebook page that I belong to but you know for somebody random like flipping through and it accidentally pops up they're watching and they're like what is this lady doing with her baby like why does she have a blanket on its head because it's a doll but uh yeah it doesn't look like one okay <gasps> Oh, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Uh, oh my gosh, she's um, incredibly realistic. She's beautiful. Oopsie doopsie doopsie, now I know. <laughs> now I know what the craze is with the Joanna K dolls. I'll take the stuff off her head. No, you you just you just went out. I'm at the good part here. Can you just hang in there? And it's raining, so I already towel dried you like 20 minutes ago. I'm so sorry. Um, okay, this little one is incredible. Um, I let me see if I can. I want to get here. I'm gonna put your diaper on. This way we can keep you modest. I'm going to take this off of her head here in a second. It's almost as if, oh, buttons, buttons, lovely buttons here. Um, do they snap? Let me see, I'm so sorry. Now, um, if you've been following Faith, she's had some extreme luck lately with her dolls. She's gotten quite a few Joanna K's. And um, so this is Sally, uh, and she, when she got her and posted her, I was like all over this baby <laughs> and like stalked her for this reason, because she made her way straight, straight. Gosh, look at that, I got some wrinkles. Um, she, she went straight to my heart, she really did. 
Hmm. I'm gonna stand back a little bit. Um, please look at her chubsters and her little rolls and her wrinkles. Hi guys, mommy, take this off my head, okay? Okay. Um, so yeah, I I had kept messaging Faith back and forth every once in a while, like, oh my god, I love her, I love her. If you ever, for whatever reason, you know, can't keep her. Oh my god. You're right, by putting that wrapping on it, kept her hair exactly the way you probably did it. Oh, Faith. She's amazing. However, did you let her go? Clara and Lexi, that's how. <laughs> <laughs> um, that is how the, she's okay. Can you tell that I'm like having a problem finding my words, which is pretty amazing because I always have something to say, but I'm having a hard time finding my words because I thought that she was incredible through the pictures that I saw but this baby in person is absolutely off the charts real looking um, I I wasn't expecting that not that I wasn't expecting an amazing baby um, but I wasn't expecting her to be like, like, like she's about ready to move and cry, you know? That's, that's crazy. I mean, she is like, she's like gorgeous. Faith, I can't thank you enough for allowing me the opportunity to be her mommy. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Here, Boo Boo. Show everybody your face. I'm so cute. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Look at that. Look at her little dupa. She has a cute little dupa. See? Oh. Lord have mercy. Oh my Lanta. Oh. oh my goodness. Look at that. I'm in heaven. I mean, I am like totally in heaven. I I I wish everybody could see her in person. You would flip a lid. Look at that baby. She is amazing. And she's got a great weight about her. Oh my God, I love her. What an awesome size too. I mean, she is such a cool size. Not too big, not, oh, peanut. She has such a great size to her. She's not like too big, but she's not so tiny. She's got a great weight to her. Oh my goodness. Let's see. Oh wow. Yes, see, I was right. I was right. I would have had major regrets not getting this muffin. Oh my God. Ah! I'm like in baby heaven. Look at me. Look at me. I'm adorable. All right, guys. That's my new one. She's pretty cute. I didn't know I was pregnant. I swear. But now that she's here, I couldn't be more grateful. Faith, thank you. And I think she came originally from Marissa Capaletti, and I'm probably destroying that name. But I, I thank both of those mommies because if it weren't for you, then she wouldn't have landed at her forever home here. And, um, and that's pretty cool that we all can like communicate with each other as we go along and you can kind of see like, okay, she's in, 
she's in good hands. Like she, she's in a, with a crazy woman, but she's in good hands. She's gonna get spoiled and she's gonna be loved and taken care of and totally cherished and that she totally will. Oh my goodness. And see, she has, I mean, she has everything. She's fully loaded. She's got armatures in her arms. She's got the squish factor. My goodness. Bye everybody. Mommy's gonna play with me now, okay? Thanks for watching my birth. Well, kind of. There she goes. Goodbye. 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 Be good. Ready? Mwah! Bye guys. Thanks for watching.